the cloud. All right. Um, it's currently 8.03 p.m. on the 17th of November. We are in the ethics and disciplinary committee meeting. We do have a quorum, one, two, three, four, four members, four out of uh, six people are here. So we do have a quorum to start the meeting. I don't want to uh, delay it. I'm gonna keep my eye on the waiting room. Um, just in case anyone comes in, I can uh, let them in. So thank you all for dialing in. Um, welcoming our new member, Veronica, to the committee. Thank you uh, for volunteering to join us. We have two other members, uh, John Johnson and um, Ken Gelnick. Uh, those are the other two committee members. So looking at the agenda, for tonight, we have to, to review the minutes for the October 2020 minutes. So um, I can pull them up on the screen so we can go over them real quick. Let's see here. All right, so you can probably see the minutes on here. So glance th through them uh, real quick and we'll uh, do a motion to approve them. You can't see it. Can, you can't see my screen? Um, Eli, you could probably zoom in on top of the screen uh, for on your phone. Well, hold on, because I'm using my laptop. Uh, Got it. Thank okay. you. I'm going to and switch to your screen. I'll scroll down in a couple of minutes, give everybody an opportunity to go through them. Scroll down just a little bit. And Kenny just joined us. Kenny, we're just Hi. going to minutes. Hi. Last month's minutes. Um, sorry, I'm late. Sorry. Right. These are the minutes from uh, last month. I don't know if you had an opportunity to read it, but uh, we're going to make the motion soon to approve the minutes. I can't seem to get out. It's only one page. It doesn't move different pages. Uh, yeah, I'm scrolling. Uh, I'm taking my time scrolling, giving, uh, giving everybody an okay. opportunity. Because I had it zoomed out. Uh -huh. I think it was hard to see if it was zoomed out. So basically, the, really the biggest changes to, to that to our form was uh, that if someone files a complaint, the subject of the complaint, uh, if they're gonna have five days to provide a response, um, that, was, uh, that was the biggest thing out of it. And after we meet, let's say, to, to, we don't have any new complaints, but if we picked up a new complaint and we're discussing it uh, today, we have 10 days to notify the subject so we're just trying to close them out a little quicker. So basically those are the minutes from uh, last month. So a motion to approve the minutes from uh, the October meeting. Do I have a second? Second. Second. Yeah, second. I think I heard Ellie first, okay. Um, up for uh, discussion. Any issues with the minutes? Okay, all in favor? Aye. 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 
No opposition. Any abstentions? All right. Passes. Okay, so that's just the first agenda item. Um, we just voted on the minutes, passed unanimously. Um, we'll go back to the agenda. Does everyone see the agenda now? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so I need a, a volunteer, please, to take minutes for tonight. Any volunteers? I'm um, sorry, I'll, I'll volunteer. I'm so sorry. I'm not, I was in, I will take notes. <laughs> Thank you, Edith. So uh, just a sh short summary. So that's the first thing we accomplished was uh, we reviewed the minutes and we, uh, and it passed. All right, so the second thing on the agenda is the conduct at meetings we have a member of the public looking to enter. I'll admit them. So the second thing on the agenda is conduct at meetings. So we had prepared a form. We discussed it, I think, last month. Um, maybe briefly. I'm not really sure. Because all these meetings are starting to uh, kind of, they're all together. Um, we were supposed to discuss it at the general meeting, but because that meeting ran long, we did not discuss it and we tabled it for next month. So has everyone uh, seen that conduct at meetings uh, letter? So I don't remember it. Yeah, can you provide us with some, uh, remember the soliciting <clears throat> and learning? Right. So it's, it's, uh, so that, that's the one we're talking about. So I think for us is really, and, and I put it on the agenda, I thought we were gonna go in depth with that, with that, but I think we reviewed it again at the leadership meeting last week and we were gonna go with it. Um, so for, for this meeting, I'm, I'm gonna skip it unless anyone has any uh, issues from the committee since we already discussed it. All right, item number three, uh, the complaint form. The complaint form, did everyone see Jeremy's uh, complaint form? Or his response or complaint form? The last edit, no, no, the, the complaint form. So if a member of a file a complaint, they, mm -hmm. can use, uh, they can use the complaint form. I don't know if I have it. Let's see if it's on the website, one second, if the new one's on the website. Second one. There it goes. Let's yeah. see if, so this is still the old one. Um, the new one has a lot more text. Give me a second. I'll uh, stop sharing for a second. I'll log into my email. Just give me one, uh, give me a couple of minutes. I'll log into my email. All right, I found it. I'm going to share my screen again. <clears throat> okay. Does everyone see the screen? Yes. Yeah. All right, so this is the new complaint form.
Did we approve this one? I'm... I think we did, but uh, I just want everybody else to take a, a look at it. So we have the new committee members here. Right. Okay, that's fine. So the previous complaint form didn't have a lot of details in it. And we wanted to attach, we wanted to give all the guidelines, all the information with the form instead of having a complaint form and a guidance uh, sheet separate. So we decided to attach it all together. So this is just the first page. I'll give you a couple of minutes to glance through it. Um, yeah. Yes. Hi, how are you? Um, I, I don't know if you guys have considered, but I mean, this is great, but is there anything going to be addressing behavior? Um, this is, this is the intake form. So if a okay. member of the public wants to fill out the form, I'm going to go down to page two. You'll, you'll see what I'm talking about. Okay. So when we go down here to page two, um, but you know what, um, Aiden and Ellie, it yes. doesn't, the, the new things that we discussed, well, it doesn't have to, right? The five days for the subject to return an answer for us to have, we have 10 days to get back to the subject. That's not really necessary. It doesn't have to be on here, right? I'm not sure. I think it should be. If, if yeah. you're just going to give them all the information, <clears throat> I get past this form. Like if they just read this form, they should they should walk away with all the information they need. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I think he's right. It's only going to be two sentences, really. That yeah, you know, the subject, yeah. I think it's a, it's going to be a simple addition. I'll ask Jeremy to uh, to add that um, the subject of the complaint has five days to respond to the committee, and the committee will. Well, before that, the committee has 10 days after the meeting to reach out to the subject. So those are the two things that we're gonna add here and I think it should be good. Here, it's basically the same thing that we had before, the name of the complainant, their okay. address, and what complaint they're submitting. And at the bottom here is um, complaint number because some members of the public might not want to, their names to be disclosed. So when we vote on it or we discuss it, we're going to go by the complaint number. And yeah. it would be 20 <clears throat> dash, you know, zero 01 for the first complaint that we get to, to number. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah. Would you have to send, because I think I spotted some, some typos that I may, that can take a look at. Okay. I'll, I'll, res, I'll uh, when I respond to Jeremy, I'm going to respond. Um, I'll attach it so you can review it and I'll ask him uh, to add the two lines or maybe if you don't mind adding it, Kenny, those two lines regarding. Uh, just, just, just send me, send them, send them to me exactly because I don't, because I don't, I don't remember exactly what was said in the two lines. If not, I'll take it down now. Okay, sure. I'll, I'll send it to you because it's in okay. the minutes from, from last okay. month. All right, so I'll uh, I'll get that to you. So okay, so we'll hold off on uh, on this, um, and maybe we'll take a look at it next month one more time, because um, it's it's a work in progress, and you know this committee's new and it's a new form. Every single meeting we run into something new, which is expected because uh, we're basically building a foundation. We built a a committee from scratch. And it's not easy. Um, we didn't have any, or we weren't aware of any other committees uh, similar to it in the Bronx that we can copy off of. Sometimes it's nice, you know, if someone is doing something, you just copy or get ideas from them. But we started from scratch, uh, and uh, here we are. 
I think uh, so far we've done really good. Um, thanks to the help of Ellie and Aiden. You've done, um, a, wonderful You've done a wonderful job. No, thank you. Uh, it, was, it was a team effort. Um, I remember from our first meeting, it, we didn't know where to start. And, uh, here, I remember the first meeting. <laughs> I think we've done good. I think we're like 80% uh, through or maybe more 90% through uh, the stuff. So uh, good experience overall. So I'll switch back to, <laughs> um, switch back to the agenda. All right. All right, um, we just talked about uh, A and then B is the public complaints. So currently we have a few complaints that are still pending. Um, they are related to um, community board staff or community board members. To discuss those complaints, we would have to go into an executive session. Uh, last month when we went into executive session, I asked uh, other community board members to leave the meeting because I wasn't sure if, if they can be in the meeting. But after speaking with the BP's office, they said, if you go into executive session during a committee meeting, other community board members are allowed to be in the, the executive session. So, um, sorry, uh, Naomi, I think I kicked you out last last month. <laughs> I did not know that information. No problem. I've been kicked out of a lot of places. No problem. <laughs> well, thank you for hanging in there. I think we were in executive session for like two hours and you waited for us until we got out. So uh, thank you for hanging in. Yeah, there. <laughs> no problem. So but before we we go, because now I the... the uh, a member of the public was asking uh, why we go into executive session. It is in the community board handbook. I think it's page 28 or 29 um, that any discussion that involves a personnel matter related to a staff or a community board member uh, must be discussed in executive session. Um, if we do vote, that vote has to be in public. Um, and before I make a motion to go into executive session, um, I'll give an opportunity for any committee members. Do you have anything before? I don't, Kelly. Okay. Um, any other members uh, of the community board? Uh, do you have anything before I go to the members of the public? Al, Naomi, do you have anything? Okay. And we'll go to members of the public. Let me go to the list to see the participants list. All right, I believe Roxanne Delgado, you're on. Um, this is your opportunity if you uh, would like to say something. Okay. All right, hearing nothing from uh, anybody, I would like to make the motion to go into executive session to discuss uh, community board uh, complaints. Uh, do I have a second? Second. Any discussion? Hello? Hello? Yes, hello. Hello, I'm sorry, hello? Okay. Say hello? Yes. Oh, okay, you said, I think you mentioned my name. I'm sorry. In regards to what? I just, I was given anybody an opportunity to, be, to speak before we go into executive session. I gave members of the committee and I'm giving an opportunity to the public to say something. Okay, my apologies, because I'm, I'm actually at work right now. So I had to lower the, the volume. But per the email that I sent, you earlier this morning. I hope you had a chance to look um, at it. Um, Ms. Delgado, there's so something wrong with, with your line. line. Just minute, uh, this week. Ms. Delgado, there's, there's something wrong with your line. With regard to importance, me, I like to say it with the executive stand. Yeah, I can't. I can't hear her either. She's breaking up. Can't hear you. Are you able to hear me? Now I, I do. 
No, I did. Now. Oh, yeah. can you hear me now? Yes. Can you hear me? Sorry, I'm at work right now, but I'm, I just stepped outside. I couldn't hear the It's I'm sorry, breaking you're, you're breaking up again. You got the Lord of the Vine. You're, 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 you're breaking up again. I can't, I cannot hear you. nearby me. But nonetheless, um, oh my goodness, this is awful. Yes. How about now? I can hear me. Yes, Ms. Delgado. Hello, you're still there? Yes. Can you hear me? Yes. Meetings. You're going in and out. Okay, then I'll address the issue by email. Okay, thank you. Anyhow, bye. Okay. All right. Um, all in favor to go into executive session? Aye. 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 Okay. Any opposition? Any abstentions? All right. Uh, just give me a minute. Um, I'm going to do two things. Um, members of the public, let's see. I don't have anyone else. Uh, we lost Ms. Delgado. So what I need to do now is pause the recording. Just give me a second. Now we are currently 10.34 p.m. We are out of executive session. We are uh, resuming our meeting. So the committee discussed some personnel matters and complaints uh, that were filed. Um, we will uh, dis discuss them briefly here before adjourning. Um, Aided, get ready to copy some stuff down. Wait, so, wait, wait. So wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't know what I did. Hold on a second. Hold on. What the hell? Give me a minute. Oh my God. Yeah, hey, is there anyone in the waiting room who needs to admit? Um, no, I don't have anybody in the waiting room. Oh my God, you guys, I can't find, I, give me a minute. I don't know what I did with the, my file. We didn't have much prior to the meeting. I think we're gonna have a lot more now. No, wait, but I, I, I think I lost what I just wrote up. I'll turn up somewhere, you didn't throw oh, it Oh, no, I found it, I found it, I found it. Hold on, I found it, I'm so sorry. Okay, hold on. 1034, we got out of uh, executive session. That's what I think. All right, so, cool. So we will, we will, uh, We'll vote on some recommendations uh, right now, but uh, we do have some complaints that were uh, discussed and closed. Um, we will, a member of the public filed uh, complaints and the dates of the incidents were April 14, June 11th, June 16th. Wait, wait, wait. 413, 2020. Uh, uh, 414, 414. Wait, 414? Yeah. Okay. And these are incidents or are these complaint these are the dates? dates? These are the dates of the incidents. Okay. Ju uh, June 11th. Okay. June 16th. And March 4th, these are all this year. Uh, those incidents, um, the committee recommends that uh, or has uh, agreed that no further action is warranted. These complaints will be closed. Um, so I will call for a motion that the dates I just mentioned um, the complaints are closed due to no further action is warranted. Do I have a second? Second. Seconded by Ellie, thank you. 
Um, discussion? Any opposition? Any abstention? This passes unanimously. So then we'll go to dates of incident of um, November 22nd of 2019. That's 11 19 May 15th of 2020. August 26th and 27th of 2020. The committee will recommend that um, FOIL guidelines will be sent to all community members and staff. Uh, I'll call on a motion for those uh, four dates for, uh, to, for that recommendation to, to send the FOIL guidelines. Do I have a second? Second. Second. Seconded by Kenny, thank you. Discussion? Any uh, opposition or abstentions? Okay, passes unanimously. And moving on to the July 17, 2020 incident, where I call for a motion that the committee recommends that we will distribute to community members and staff the New York City social media policy. Do I have a second? I second. Seconded by Naomi. And uh, just to make it official, Naomi uh, has uh, now uh, now a community board uh, correction, a committee member of the uh, ethics committee. Um, Or do I have is a discussion? Any uh, abstentions or anyone against? Okay, that passes unanimously. Okay, we did review two complaints that were submitted in October of 2020. One of the incidents was October 7th, 2020. A member of the uh, public filed a complaint. So I call for a motion for the October 7th, 2020 uh, um, for, the, for that complaint to be that it's partially substantiated. And after reviewing it, we have decided to close the complaint because there was a technical issue during that meeting. Do I have a second? So I'll second it. All right, seconded by Ken. Uh, discussion? Abstentions or any uh, anyone against? Okay, that passes unanimously. And lastly, um, complaint submitted um, for incident, or a complaint submitted on October 27th of 2020 that references numerous dates from uh, starting March 22nd. So I call for a motion that the committee recommends. I'm sorry, when was it submitted? It was submitted October 27th, 2020. So okay. I'm calling for a motion that the committee recommends that dial in options or dial in instructions or options are included in the invites and that the calendar is updated routinely. And lastly, 
that the community board will comply with all open meetings laws. Do I have a second? Second. Okay. Naomi, thank you. Uh, discussion? Okay. Um, anyone against? Anyone abstaining? Okay, that passes unanimously. Thank you, everyone. And that closes it out for the public complaint section. That was item number three on the agenda. Item number four is old business. No old business, uh, new business, item number five. No new business, okay. And Bill, because committees do not require a, uh, a motion to adjourn, um, does anyone have anything else before we adjourn? Um. I wanna thank uh, Aided for taking uh, the minutes. Um, if you don't mind sending them to us, we'll all yes. take a glance at them and then yep. we'll, we'll forward them up uh, to be published. Um, and we'll vote on them next month. Anything else from anybody? Thank you so much for uh, sacrificing hours of your time. I, I really appreciate you. Um, this is uh, a lot of hard work we're doing. So thank you so much. And I'll talk to everybody in two days. Thank Have, you. A good Have a good night, Sounds guys. Good. Thank you. Take care. Thank, thank you, everyone. Good night, everybody. Bye, Have a good one. Good night, everybody. Bye, guys. When we leave the meeting.